Hello. Hello. I am Jay. I'm TJ. And this is Not Quite Nerds. Not Quite Cool Kids. Welcome back. We're back for episode 14. Yes. Uh, junior year fantasy high. We all know all the things. We're so excited be- to be back today. Yes. Can I just say first that I'm wearing these glasses. I've mentioned it before. <laughs> Um, it's really hot outside and this is UV filtering and I don't have anything else. So I'm sorry that it looks so annoying. Um, and a small disclaimer, (laughs) thank you. Um, a small disclaimer is, um, we actually filmed the first part of this reaction, just a small part of the beginning. Um, yesterday so the lighting will be a little bit different but this is still the first time that we're watching it just the first kind of secretly react to the whole episode yeah (laughs) and then do it again um so yeah so the lighting will be quite different um but the rest of it is as normal yes and do all the things like subscribe comments below theories and all the things let's get into today's reaction Mm. There should be more the sequels that are the name twice. Of Ankarna, <laughs> yeah. of Instead of, two, sort of Fast and, and the Furious Furious. Yeah. <laughs> fast and the Furious, <laughs> Fast and the Furious. They didn't want a dance contest. My champions, the plot of Honey. I'm Jessica Alba. Oh, yeah, the Oracle. Oracle. What if they accidentally revealed Ankarna and then now the um, the stupid copper poopals um, want to serve her? The poopal coppers. Kimberly Lee Cooper Father. Uh, we love the book. Can they please sell them, please? Yeah. yeah. Get all your school books, but they're all with the um Albert himself, Mr. Bobby Don. We didn't even talk about him in the last episode. Uh, <laughs> it was just terrifying. Looks at you. Says, it literally looks like the Kentucky Fried Chicken Man. Class. You can go ahead and take your scene out That's on just the gun. Students! Not the church organs. Junior year Clara track here at the Egg Ford Adventuring Academy. But in my capacity here at this academy, I will, of course, not be proselytizing, but rather a neutral party. Here simply to help facilitate your devotion to your various and sundry divinities. Even he looks different. So... Uh, we will begin with a short lecture on the nature of He's faith as like it this. pertains yeah, yeah. to a pantheon and cross regionally. Uh, you see that he goes and starts drawing stuff up on the chalkboard. Kristen, do you just sit down and just like start observing in the class, or is there anything that you're doing as you take a seat? No, I do. I think I'm. I'm gonna really try to be under the radar here. I think. Uh, but give me an insight check. Is the other guy in her class? There is an unmistakable bent to Mr. Don's uh, lecture that has the structure of a sermon. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Totally. He's clearly not like uh, Professor Badgood. Certain students in the class get a harsher type of question than others. But we can go ahead and continue with your downtime activity. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, they only did like three, three people doing downtime. Well, I'm gonna do time. academics probably. First. Okay. Cool. I like that sound effect. It's so it's like some wit. Uh, it's, yeah. it's not very. Like it's a wet whistle. It's not like. Thick, 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 thick. It's like yeah, it's like a wet whistle. Do a popularity. <laughs> Um, but specifically, I want to go yes. with... <laughs> yeah. Like, it sounds like a little beetle car. Yeah. I want to go, I want to go flirt with... Hey, Gertie! Hey, Gertie! Is that entirely why you're dating Gertie? Yeah. We love Gertie, okay? I'm sorry that we cut her out of the other episode. 21 means you get that second tier of popularity. We should buy shirts that say we love Gertie. Uh, we love Gertie, okay? I promise I love Gertie. I'm sorry I cut Gertie. Lovely, like, She'd probably uh, kill me. Lovely, like, girl. She's sort of like about 6'5 six, six or 6'6 six, six and got big glasses on under that big apiarist thing. She's, you know, all protected. Uh, oh, she's bless her. She's into the beehives and turns around and says, Oh! Hey, oh, Gertie! Oh, Kristen, hello! Just have a seat. Hey, Gertie! The beehives and turns around and says, oh, That's so oh, cute. Damn. <laughs> 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 I hate this. What a... You just look good. I'm sorry. Um, oh, well, <laughs> I, uh, I, I don't exactly think that my apiarist's protective uniform is uh, form-fitting, but uh, I guess if you've got it flaunted, hubba hubba. <laughs> I like you, Gertie. 
Uh, um, we should go out sometime. Uh, but uh, other than that, I'm actually here on business. No! <laughs> you see, she says, well, if you want to get, uh, yeah, uh, whew, ha, ha, it's hot in this. Uh, uh, yeah, tell me what you want. Um, yeah, well, I need to do the Murph. Look at the stars, but maybe we can go and get dinner there. I don't know. If you, maybe hey. it's some kind of discount. The stars kind of lenient. Um, but I was wondering, um, yeah, it was sort of interesting. I feel like maybe just one of the trucks is using it as like a garnish or something like that. Because if you were using it as if you were trying to make like big sheets of like a baklava or something like that, you'd need way more than I made. Yeah. Uh, oh, so they got it in right. trucks. Huh. No, just like if you were gonna put it on baklava, right? Just to be specific. I love baklava. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Right. okay. I was oh, thinking Kimberly was already doing it. Yeah, yeah I was already okay. doing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of the many honeyed confections, I believe baklava is king. <laughs> <laughs> I love a little yogurt with a little honey on it. Um, I like a little uh, honey. I'll give you as much time as you need. I'll get back to you tomorrow. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> um, okay, well, I, you know what? If they order more, would you tell me? And I was thinking maybe we'd try something kind of funny. Uh, I don't think I would feel comfortable telling a fib. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Listen, I think, I sh I think we should call out the elephant in the room. I have feelings for you. Oh, yeah. I think she's like, going to say, I know you want to watch. I know you want me. <laughs> Kind of a Shakespearean in that way, huh? Very tragic. <laughs> we are, I am afraid, star-crossed. We're star-crossed. Oh, well, <laughs> I just think they need I'm to take her no, to the no. Fey realm and <laughs> try that honey. Because <laughs> she can't be grumpy about it. Sir, did you mind? Uh, uh, could, I, could I see the logs of the aviary uh, honey that you've given out? I'd love to just... Snap some pictures of them on my crystal. I'm working on a big project. But she looks over at you and says, absolutely. And I say, well, even without having to roll a mystery check, just based on the popularity, she takes you through, um, and you see in the logs that the first delivery of Devil's Nectar to make Devil's Honey happened about a week or two after spring break last year. Oh, interesting. So even so before so long uh, uh, Lucy died. Even before Lucy died. Before spring break last year, what were the rat grinders doing? So we and Sam had a big project. Okay, cool. Well... Was to forget I that, that they saw the one day. road professor? Huh? <laughs> hmm? Oh, Dick, oh, Dick, gotcha. Oh, it's beautiful. Is it Tim, as they say? Yes, yes, definitely. Um, definitely. I'm a <laughs> My parents? Yeah. So Ooh. I'll go do a family Why were we doing that? Hell yeah. And then after that, Did I'm they say what? Do. Mary for the campaign. Right. Cool. You end up going to um, diner and you see Mac and Donna are there and you see that your younger siblings are all there okay. um, as well. Uh, you see Bucky comes up and gives you a big hug. Hey. Uh, hey. At different times we've attacked each other, but um, I'm going to definitely believe that it was oh uh, my God. someone being charmed. Gotcha. Um, <laughs> gotcha. I'm having, well, my, my party's having a hard time now because none of them are converting to Helio, so it's a little oh. stressful, but... Um, you know, sorry. I'm surprised that he's in a non helio yeah, party. Well, he, well, You'd feel like that was like. Goes, well, the issue is they're not converting. Ah, uh, okay, okay. I, I like yeah. kind of quietly meditate within. You catch a lot more bees with sugar. <laughs> catch a lot more sugar. <laughs> uh, so Mac and Donna look. Cute. <laughs> nice of you to uh, to reach out, Kristen. Thank you. Yeah. Parentalized child. <laughs> well, you know. Um, <laughs> We, you, you I hate it. To us. I hate some, it. Yeah. Uh, some things on your mind. Um, we'd be happy to talk to you about. You know. Do you think that she's away. coming back to the face? Yeah. Uh, with uh, we got a we got a new teacher. Right? We got a. Uh, we were really Khan. happy. We were really happy. It looks like we, now that that uh, that bum uh, is out of, is out of the the cockpit. Looks like some good she decisions. She died. <laughs> she was murdered. Oh, she was murdered. Yes. Uh, I thought she got fired. Oh. No, she was she was absolutely How murdered. How do you? <laughs> Do they, do they look actually remorseful for that? Yeah, well, yeah. Okay, you see, okay, they're okay, like, okay. ah. I didn't know. Uh, <laughs> okay. Well, you know, nobody should be murdered other than by Helio. <laughs> so I don't agree with that. Oh, my God. I don't agree with that. The, are uh, they supposed to know that she got you know, murdered? I, that, you know, I feel like it should be kind of knowledge, instead. right? Not like, the school would have just been like, told. Like, is it not in the newspaper? You know, yeah. You know, but I will say, you know. Because they feel like the type that would read a newspaper. Papler? Papler. Um... My voice just gets so high from the rest of the time. I guess so. Uh, <laughs> you see, they say, but. Uh, Galakea and, and Helio. There, there was a big mix of different people. I thought that was really interesting. Do you guys like Galakea? Uh, the, what's this, the elf god? Yeah. Uh, you know, hey, 
why has she not told them that like she's never really talked about meeting these people you know a demon I mean, I don't, to, be, to be honest, Kristen, I know that you, uh, I know that you had a roommate or a friend who was a, a worshiper of Galatea. A roommate or a friend. friend. And that's all fine, you know. But <laughs> you know, it's like you could, you can worship a god that tells you, you know, how to be a werewolf, or you can worship one that can cure you of being a werewolf. And it just seems, I don't know. I don't. I, I, Kristen, you know, I think I'm on. I think I'm on the record here. I think you know how we feel. Um, yeah, well, oh okay. my gosh. I just, uh, I it hurts. Out and just kinda, she literally lives with a werewolf. Like, I'm alive, you're alive. Yeah. Uh, I want to come back to church with you guys some some Sunday, but just once, uh, and just just to pop in and kind of see what it's like, you know, for they my prayer classes, and Bobby's my teacher now, so I just wanted to let you guys know, and I'd love to. Maybe see, they look at each other with this, like, uh, like feverish kind of look, <laughs> and it's like, you see your mom goes, well, that'd be wonderful, Kristen. Yeah. That'd be wonderful. You know, a lot of people left the church these last couple months. Really? Yeah, oh. You no know, long night, yeah. no sun. Mm. You know, I know you might think this is stupid, but I know that you're worshiping another god, but isn't it kind of funny that Helio chose you and you were the one to bring the daytime back? That doesn't feel mm. special at all to you? It doesn't feel like maybe, maybe you got it wrong? Well, I mean, it wasn't just me. It was Plus. all the photosynthetic. <laughs> Why did they fall? Oh. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh. Okay, no, I had to come back for that. Wait, it's fine. So we'll keep it in. Figure it out. Figure it out. We can keep it in. Yeah, just we can keep it. <laughs> um, I'm just looking for Ruby. That's so freaking funny. I, I love it because you heard it, but I saw it. I read photos yeah, of yeah. the kids, but you actually like it doesn't feel registered special it. at all to you. It doesn't feel like maybe, maybe you got it wrong. Well, I mean, it wasn't just me. It was all the photos sent the kids. Where's it be sad? Oh, same cup. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. You're welcome to come by church anytime you want. Yeah, great. Well, is that your, is that your crystal? No, no, these are, um... This is my god. These are the shards of my god, uh, Cassandra, the god of doubt and uncertainty, and, um... Bucky raises a hand, and you see that Mac, your dad, grabs his hand really hard and says, Okay, that's enough. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll treat you to lunch, Kristen. Cool, thank So you. we'll leave it at the counter. Can I get a uh, roast beef sandwich to go, uh, <laughs> potato salad to go? Um, <laughs> Four orders of fries. Was that Emily? Um, Listen to that laugh by Emily. Um, <laughs> Interesting. As soon as it was over, it was over. Like it's like all of that. Like oh, there's growth here, and da 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 da. And like I'm sharing in your faith, but as soon as it was like anything about her faith, it was like yeah, like cut it off, cut it off. Like we don't need to talk about it. Like let's not ruin a bad moment, kind of thing. Yeah. A good moment. Okay, that's your relationship check there. Go ahead oh. and roll a d6 for me if you'd be so kind. Got this, Kristen. Two. You go ahead and. How many orders of fries I got? How many orders of fries you got? Is there anything else? The final roll is uh, for the campaign. You got it for, for the presidential campaign. Go ahead and roll. Oh no! It's like okay, D6 just to roll to see if you do a good job in this campaign. Check. Check. Yes, you can. SD8. Yes. Yes. Kristen, so you're good. Shepherd. You can see yeah, with her in the cafeteria or in the rat finders, especially, but, but primarily from Kipper Lily, you can just sense this boiling fucking rage. <gasps> that as like people rage. Are chanting your name. Yeah, I know. Words, but... <laughs> words gotten out like Applebee, it's always happy hour. Because word, word has gotten out that you are acing cleric classes yep. with a dead god. And it's just, like, <laughs> it's just, just not dead. Just not dead. Oh, kiss and drugs. Kiss and drugs. Kiss and drugs. <laughs> literature at Fabian's lo-fi study hours. Oh, like, there's actually a conversation one day uh -huh. in the cafeteria. And I actually had a moment when um, a little painter's a cap. chant of like kiss and drugs, like it's always happy hour at Applebee's, uh, comes up in the middle of Kipper Lily doing a little presentation in the cafeteria. Uh oh. Uh, and walking by your table, Kipper Lily turns over and goes, So I say congratulations. Her eyes are so scary. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> she looks like she wants to murder them. Um, 
My friend's doing a bunch of stuff with the Apiary Club. Seems cool. <gasps> mm. I know you're involved in a lot of the extracurriculars. That's really exciting. Yeah. Thanks. You are too, right? Yeah. Yes, I'm in a Putting a few orders, yeah. Oh! <laughs> For the devil's honey. What are you trying to forget, Cabrillo? <gasps> <laughs> you do have a bite of 12. You definitely have 12. 6, that's 18. Oh my Plus god. 3, 21. Oh my god. It's really nice how charmed everyone oh is. Oh my god. I hardly <laughs> fucking care. Oh! It's egg on my face for wanting something. Egg on my face. Security detail! Security detail! Security detail! Moment. Call him Counterspell! <laughs> <laughs> He's like reconstituting himself. Oh my god, no! God, no! Body plastic to bits becomes Counterspell! There's a true square-up moment where you're scared of this. Oh my god. Uh, uh, five questions for you. Stop. Uh, you see that, uh, oh, she goes, guys, this is stupid. Come on, come on. You look at Marianne's cuddle goes, <laughs> Riz doesn't look at Marianne. Yeah, what of it? Just not <laughs> picking eye at looking past her at her machine. Marianne would be like, you could do so much better than this. How do you mean? You You're just really fucking cool. Yeah, we love Marianne. This is a message, guys. Don't guys, join I it. I think she's too far back. <laughs> <laughs> now whenever I see Kip and Lily, I go... Don't fuck with Marianne. Don't, don't, don't even try to talk to her. I'm afraid of any of the other ones. Only oh, Marianne. I tried to tackle Gorgog and it just didn't happen. And she just tackled Gorgog is looking so at Marianne and touching his uh, potion of fire. <laughs> <laughs> is that mango soda? Is it mango soda? <laughs> this freak thinks it's mango soda. <laughs> Size. Let's just walk in the light of Helio. We don't need to be. We don't need to call He's somebody. almost right. Uh, but <laughs> I got. I think I got Marianne like a big squish mellow uh, seahorse stuffed animal. That's so cute. Uh, hey Marianne, I um. Oh, we, we are trying <gasps> oh, to. Oh, and then they put the thing in the thing. People, uh, and I just thought of you when they <laughs> said the. Uh, <laughs> Go ahead and give me a persuasion check. <laughs> or just live it. <laughs> oh, I love it. Eighteen. Uh, you see, she takes it and goes, "I have this one." Oh, uh, <laughs> that's fine. So you don't need it. Because you could have twins. I'll give it to Toy Bank. And you see if she walks off. Okay. I'm just trying to get us giving them gifts in the mix, so maybe we We're can not ready. something. <laughs> We're, not okay. ready. Okay. We're, We're not right. ready. We're not ready. We're not ready. You don't, you haven't seen what I've seen. She's uh, got that dog in her. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I love it. Like, Everyone's scared of Marianne. Take her away no, no, from no, them. No, yes. We need to separate her, isolate her from the group, get her on our. Yeah. She's the only one we need to buy gifts yes, for. Exactly. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know. The wizard, the they are going in with yeah. no plan uh, and talking no, after. During. Uh, yeah. During. <laughs> Even worse. Come on. Yeah. Or guidance. Yeah, then you get a 2D fours. Or what's your flash? It just adds three. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> Bardic? Bardic inspiration added D8? Do you want another Bardic? <laughs> <laughs> you want another Bardic? <laughs> we gotta know what the hottie thinks of you, <laughs> Adine. Look, we're trying to make this. This is O'Sheen, right? Yeah. We're literally like aiming at Adine's head. <laughs> 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 20. Got it. D uh, dirty 20. I rolled a four. Oh, you rolled a four and got to <laughs> and a dirty 20. Wait, 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 wait. So that has, is uh, poetic. Everyone has to point out to Tata that O'Sheen has a finger up like he's waiting to make a point but as he does uh you see as you make eye contact he messages you and just goes sorry like he's apologizing for his friends and then he just moves away you see uh they all head over to the vending machine yeah we love the little messages on the side absolutely not i don't think she's complicated it's not that complicated she's just so strong that's what's so thrilling about her she's gonna kill us all a lack of but an hour of her talking gorgog punches a wall i love that gorgog's in his own world in the side gorgog you're not ready yet also i have to be honest i've been self-producing me wait wait it's you it's me what are you all has it been you are you saying we've been all 40 complicated women <laughs> and their guy producer. <laughs> and their guy producer. <laughs> that is an A plus barbarian porter could not be happy. I'm in, in the class like picturing uh Marie. Mary What's her name? Marianne. 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 <laughs> yeah. Marianne is porter. Like, no, I'm just the punching bag. I want you to picture arch nemesis. <laughs> you know, it can be a dragon, a leech, uh evil. Mega soda. <laughs> <laughs> Out the other side. That oh, is so wholesome. Really does it. <laughs> not my don't talk to me. Oh my God. <laughs> everybody, everybody give us my <laughs> 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 <laughs>
twirling around with my fist. I love the idea that Gorgak is this lanky, ragey boy. Yeah. Stunning. Stunning. Uh, now I add a shitload. Your tickets will see you when you double your prisons. Yeah, so 18 plus 13, 31. Oh my um, god! Oh. It's bad. It's Come on, MCAT. Just yeah. Also, merge yes. the wrong mm -hmm. way. Um, Henry is blown away, and we formally unlock the Barbafisser subclass. <gasps> yeah. um, Yay! Bar Barbenheimer. Barb There's actually a moment where Barb Porter and Henry like, Barb Barb square up in the gym to watch <laughs> you kind of like reveal. Like, what's this like new technology that Gorgog's got? Out of like sort of the culmination <laughs> of all of this work. In trying to combine the uh, barbarian and artificer stuff, has like figured out the ways in which to like, I think in our conversation on it, it's sort of like gadgety. It's like very like Batman-y. So he has like, I think like, <laughs> just like a vest that has a bunch of little like gadgets on it that has like, I think Cloaca's uh, brain in it. <laughs> I suck! Uh, I'm just gonna do damage resistance. <laughs> so you see that Henry right now has an immunity to lightning damage, damage resistance resist. to poison, and <laughs> well, resistance crazy. to cold. He's figuring out his oh, okay. damage resistance. Oh, you got a lot of stuff. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> All right. Well, here's the big test. Enter into your sort of you know barbarian battle state while keeping one of your artificer effects running. So mm -hmm. effects wise, you mean like concentration? Yeah, the concentration. Okay. I'll use. Uh, enlarge on myself to just become huge. Oh, go into a rage and then or enlarge and then go into enlarge a rage. and pick up a boulder off the ground. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> keep it. Yeah, it was just like <laughs> as like a matter generator. That's so epic. Grow to about ten feet in size, oh, and you no. fly to a rage, <laughs> grab a boulder and just <laughs> hurl it across the gym. Boulder goes. That's what I'm fucking talking about. This is what I was talking about. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, dude, so true. Uh, so true. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Having some good advice for you, Dom. I get it. I just can't process that feeling right now. <laughs> and Henry goes, this is incredible. It's, for most people, rage really rattles and confuses them. Yeah, do this shit. Uh, what, kind of, what, kind of, uh, what kind of skill do you He's want? really Suspicion, pushing that one. Mystery. I wonder Restrain. if it, it'll pay off. Henry. Check in regards to Henry. Yes, you can. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Because... Uh, I just am still trying to figure out why he had all that Grick stuff, what his relationship yeah. is to yeah. Grick's and everything like that. Mm -hmm. DC for this is 15. So, yeah. also, Ruben. There's a period after class where oh, you've mysterious. gotten access to this like motherboard looking at it. Um, you get to look at Henry's notes. First of all, you do see some uh, correspondence in his, in his desk that is like a note uh, from Ruben oh asking for a ride home, uh, who is okay. his nephew. Oh, can I look for any evidence of the cloud <gasps> drive? The, oh, the cloud rider engine here. You don't find any evidence here of, of a cloud rider or anything. As you're in the room, you hear something outside, which you hear of the approach of Henry coming to class. And you kind of, I think, maybe he actually scratched staying behind. He like came early when you knew there wouldn't be a period in here, because it's a little bit less suspicious to be found mm -hmm. here if you're just like early mm -hmm. for class. And you hear Henry approaching. And without hearing any footsteps approaching, you hear a sudden voice going, Mr. Hopclap, and you hear the voice of Jace Stardiamond, okay. the vice principal. Okay. And you hear us uh, say, oh, uh, Jace, hi, hello. Oh, without and hearing the hi, footsteps. Uh, sorry to grab you. I just wanted to okay. speak He's really briefly. Um, oh. I got your letter about Ruben. Um, obviously, you know, you're working here with family, and that's happened in the past. You know, we've had other teachers that work here with siblings or other things like that. Uh, I just wanted to assure you that... Uh, you I don't know if the police sirens are in the show or not. I didn't have time to get to every sort of point in the letter, but I just wanted to assure you that we're monitoring everything and it's all fine. Uh, and you see that Henry goes, okay, uh, some of my questions were, uh, I'd love to actually have a meeting if we could to go over it. And you see Chase goes, well, I mean, I, you know, it's, it's pretty busy. I think the easier thing to do would be to just meet at the end of the school year when Principal Eggfort returns and do things that way. You see Henry says, right, but some of these concerns are a little more and you hear a sudden, <laughs> like a misty step, a little like short range teleportation, and you hear Jay say, I think it was pretty fucking clear. Oh my God. We'll talk about it at the end of the year, Hopclap. I'd love for you to keep your little fucking nose <gasps> out of other people's business for the time being. How does that sound? Oh my God. Mr. Star Diamond, if I've done anything to offend, well, clearly you have. You're a brand new teacher. Oh my God. Maybe pipe down and let veteran educators at this school do their fucking that job. That is not the vibe. You. Uh, and you hear Jace Helpworth. Uh, I put my headphones on. Oh, oh nice. Nice. <laughs> like hitting two bars together. <laughs> a, very, a very rattled Henry comes in. <laughs> <laughs> like numbed out. Yeah. 
Hey, I'm just, uh, just, you know, working on, on school. I got a lot of school. Yeah, what's sort of the utility of hitting these two bars together? <laughs> well, you know, when I think about it... You're a drummer, bro. I think that how music is in everything. And, um, and that's something, and I'm, and I'm thinking that will eventually bend back around to... Uh, music has clearly been a key for you in uniting... Wait, we have to... Homeroom. That was crazy. Dang, what is it? What is it? I'm thinking my, my initial thoughts was when he did the when he did the short range teleportation, I thought it was the rogue professor coming into the conversation. That was my first thought. Mm -hmm. But now I'm wondering if because he said like keep out of biz the business. Yeah. Keep out of people like keep out of my business. What is it about? So he's involved with the rat grinders. Cause Hop Clap is raising the issues and he doesn't want to talk about it. Yeah. 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 So he's like, Wait it's the okay. End of the year. I think it's fine. Maybe he doesn't like. He just doesn't want anyone to touch it. But also maybe he does. Maybe he's siding with the rat grinders because he doesn't like these guys either. Because of all the. Maybe. I, I, I'm... Whatever they're up to, he's. <laughs> he's in on it. He's in on it somehow. Okay. Uh, strong emotion mm -hmm. with pattern and analysis. I mean, music theory is such a beautiful marriage of what is fundamentally primal and then How what is, Brennan is doing extremely this? cerebral. Oh, that was yeah, the other thing I was going to say. Sorry. That was the other thing I was going to say is Brennan acting really well and, and doing a good job of like voicing those two characters, but also simultaneously like giving the vibe of like, guys, I'm giving you the tea. Like his eyes were like so... Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, I'm divulging It's like you can see him getting excited. Like, it's, like, it's almost like his eye reactions are on the at You can the table. play because he's just... So but I agree. Like at the, especially at the end, he's like, he's like, as he wraps up and everyone's ga gabber flasted, he's like, yeah, music everywhere. All right. Uh, and you see that other students start to file in. In the wizard class, we're like, what is happening? Oh, he needs a twenty to succeed. He needs a twenty to succeed. That's okay. I'm trying to think if I care I like about Owlbear. <laughs> I feel like the narrative of Owlbear's not doing well is very funny. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't actually ruin our chances for things if I fail out of Owlbear. You've already had a failure, so you risk being cut from the team. And if I'm cut from the team... It does, it's, not, it's unclear what the mechanical penalties of that would be, but... The emotional ones would be... <laughs> 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 He's just sitting there drinking... I just don't think I care about Owlbear. <laughs> I'm just gonna let it go. Classic junior so, year dilemma. Given, given all the soccer girls I knew. Give a choice between <laughs> getting all the way to a rage token. Your fifth stress token becomes a rage token. You elect not to push yourself and like burn out. You and, and you do. I don't really care about owlbears. I'm sorry. I just I felt this way for a long time. Don't care about owlbears. I don't know if I ever did. Oh. Uh. I just felt like when the kind of it just sort of opened up to us and I don't know. I just felt like I should do it because. I was gonna probably be good at it to a degree, but I just don't like it. I don't like doing it. I don't like the vibe of hanging out with a lot of like all the towel slapping we do. <laughs> I love getting towel slapped, going back. There's a moment after every practice where you do your helicopter noise with the towel. <laughs> Do I find you? Yeah. I'm hiding from you. Yes. And I just don't know if I I have it in me to keep keep on the team. What are you even gonna do after school now? Like, go to sleep, um, <laughs> maybe work out what's going on with our school, uh, <laughs> see if there's, like, any sort of large gods interfering with our... <laughs> yeah, I guess that's important. I know it's where we would hang out. Yes, exactly. It's like, if you're not on the team, like, I guess we just, you know, but anytime we hang out, we're always, like, trying to save the world at the same time. It's just, like, this was a nice place where, like, you and I could just be bros and, uh. you know, I could find you and slap you as hard as I could with a towel. Do you see what it feels like? Well, I never do because I always dodge yours. Just take one. Okay. You, oh, you want me to just take one? Yeah. You're right. gonna quit. I'm <laughs> quitting, no matter what. Wait. <laughs> if this doesn't hurt, then I'll try to stay on this. Okay, great. All right, Go ahead. Ready? Set. Did that hurt? What? Did that hurt? No. No, it doesn't hurt. That's not a truth. <laughs> <laughs> Does it again? Yeah, I'm trying to like learn how to do other stuff. Okay. <laughs> oh, I love you. that. I miss you too. Oh. I miss you a lot. Yeah, I'll see you all the time. Yeah. Yeah. Like, um, hey guys, I'm still the equipment manager. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> both fresh towels. 
<laughs> Incredible. Uh, Kurt Black. Actually, actually skipping school and smoking in the locker room. Oh, okay. <laughs> the, everyone's in there. I'm in here too. I'm uh, kind of passing out some flyers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we we just need add on. Add on that kind of guy there. <laughs> You have other ambitions in them, so... I love them. That's fine. just want you to know that you were very gifted at this. Thank you. I... <laughs> so I'm pleased. Yeah, appreciate that. I love the vibe of teachers just... really wanting them to no succeed. No, there's a big game's coming up. We'll try to get someone off the bench who can place you. Probably the equipment manager could be right here. Can add all the practices, watching all the stuff. Just all think right. about this story. That, like, think that. about the story. Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> all right, the ball, ball you're up. Yeah. 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 Oh, you're up. You're up. Uh, but, Think about the story. Uh, 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 incredible. Oh, really? That I was walk in. They were being like, maybe I should take a stress token to try and keep Gorgo going. Yeah. <laughs> no, we've got okay. nothing. No, it's perfect. It's a perfect story for junior year. You, something's got to drop. Plates yeah. have to fucking drop, yes. man. Yeah. Uh, there's too much shit. Riz and Fig. Right, I got some stuff. They should get it to the on the next time. Keep it up for academics. Let's do it. Because they're tempting. Really yeah. Because um, they're tempting. 31. Incredible. Rogue, A+. Plus. Do you find the Rogue? Yeah, I'm looking for the... Rogue teacher is DC 30. <gasps> Holy shit. Ah! We are going to hold on to that one. Wait, wait, wait. Go back. Go back. 31. Incredible. Rogue, A+. Plus. Do you find the Rogue? Yeah, I'm looking for the... Rogue teacher is DC 30. <gasps> Holy shit. Oh, that's such a gimme act because I love this. It's so low energy. You find the name somewhere in the school resources of Eugenia oh, Shadow, ah. which is the Rogue teacher's name. And what you find is information about when Eugenia Shadow died. <gasps> Ghost. And that, you feel like, is enough to know that somewhere, you somehow, this. you will be able to track her down. So we'll come to that. Homeroom, you called it. The road teacher was the ghost lady. And the... the ghost person. The, the fridge lady. ghosties. The ghost the steaks are from the road <laughs> performer. I freaking know. You called it in, like, the second episode? Or? I think, well, because I think I thought about it. Oh because, no, when well, Kipper Lily. He, because he keeps bringing it up. Yeah, something ghosty. Well, he keeps bringing up the ghost sticks in the fridge. I thought it was just a bit. Yeah, but Brendan doesn't all. Like, he'll do bits to a point. Like, yeah. this is a season one, episode one bit. Yeah. Like, at some point, it has to pay off. Like, the vultures paid off. True, that's true. We're not, like, we're not playing games here. No, just we're I not playing it. a game here. Even I though love we're it. literally I'm so playing excited to see what happens. Because that is huge. <laughs> well done, Riz. Okay. Oh, oh, she, she looks so cute. Did you see her? Yeah. Um, but then I'll do um, my extracurriculars. I think it's um, going to be an old crew. So, how did it become? 20. How did she die? 30, 20. Incredible. A technicality for Kipper Lily to find her. I'm trying to think if there was any meaning behind the high five heroes. Like, if there was some adventure that they were on that then caused them to become the rack grinders. Like, what traumatized them into. Cheesing the system. Mm. Go ahead. True, like, like, you, know, know, your third role, so you don't just you decide to get more powerful. But you, power you can kind of think about that. As, as right? Like, you'd like, have to yeah. have a reason to get to that point if you normally you get like a, a basic clue on a 15. So, so that's bumped like, up a little bit. But it's like 20, 25, milestone 30. Milestone leveling to at. suddenly go in XP leveling. 23. Looking at the rack range and specifically trying to follow the devil's honey track. On 23, you don't find any big breakthrough, but you find a couple small things. You see Gertie's talking to you and mentions like, yeah, I mean, the property's, uh, I know Preston, <laughs> what a gal. The uh, eyes. Was talking about, um, uh, <laughs> was talking about, it was talking about devil's honey. The fascinating part of devil's honey in terms of why it makes you such a good liar is not only the sort of honey in the tongue, but the way it works is you are momentarily deceiving yourself. Uh, which is what makes you so convincing. Because it's the same all theme the as all the other ones. Is it something to do with the spy's the tongue? The yeah. Like, are they trying to create a spy's tongue? Yeah. studies on it about whether people need to actually speak or not. And it turns out even people just thinking a lie were able to lie effectively. Uh, which, of course, mm. you might think, well, how, you know, what's the use of that? But, of course, there's a lot for, um, for wizards that are casting a message can trip or telepathic communication. Mm. And, of course, the biggest one, which is originally what the sort of original use of the devil's honey were, was to lie in prayer. Oh, oh is that how you shit. came to the belief of it? Like what a god was the god of? I think so. <laughs> it's like we all have to go to church. Um, <gasps> yeah, I'm That'd be so cute. Cool. Cool. 23 as well, I will say, as you are walking through That's the so hall, crazy. Just all of them going to church together library. after the last year's prayer yeah, chain? <laughs> just in the back. Well, the bad kids in the back. First year's prayer chain. Oh, pretty come pretty on, kiddo. You're all right. Here, look at you. Uh, it's nice to see you. I thought maybe he was going to turn out to be the rogue professor. Sorry, I talk when I trance. Yeah, no, I... Uh, Fabian dance battle. Well, that was so interesting. That last like. Bit. 
Absolutely wild. I guess if you just live forever, you get... If I had a copper piece for every time the structure of my life was changed by a dance band. <laughs> I've written Constitution, uh, and they it's like literally not written anywhere. They just remember it. All right, well, I gotta go do, do my office hours. You see, as he walks, he sees Riz in the hall. I walks around being like, hey, Riz, how you doing there? Um, you know, do, doing okay. I'm just wondering, because I know Copper Lily is like one of the other, only other people that... Copper Lily. Kip, Copper Lily, why? I, usually I'm the one who gets it right. <laughs> Right. Junior year. Uh, was it during spring break last year that they... It happened this year. Hmm. We just started. Interesting. Yeah, she, it was like first day of school. She... Yeah, you see, he says, yeah, it happened 8.01 a.m. on the first day of school. Oh, my God. The road teacher went and found her. Then she applied to student body president. The f- said... Yeah, the first minute that it would have been mm-hmm. uh, allowable. I, I guess I'm just, I'm confused how somebody who is mostly just killing rats is finding the rogue teacher within a minute was there any I, I massage wrist so just because you've got all the like, levels uh, does not mean that you're good at your job that to me just doesn't seem that yeah. fair <laughs> uh, but before they were the rat grinders did they have any kind of big assignments or anything like that it just seems strange to me that i'm gonna say here riz uh, with just with your passive perception you become aware that there are things in kipper lily's file that you saw there mm-hmm. it would mean stealing from jawbone's office that's fine. Oh, that's fine to steal. I thought you were saying that's yeah, fine. Yeah. I don't need them. Trickster, I do have, um, I believe my mage hand can be invisible now. Cool. I, do you want to give me a sleight of hand check? Go for it. Cool. Can I do like these? Why are you doors? doing it while he's in there? Well, if they're talking and he has a mage hand. Oh, okay. 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 <laughs> I glitched all over you. I'm so sorry. I'm so old, excited. Old Murph who, baby? I don't even recognize him. He's rolled so good this season. That's um, true. I think Riz, you got you the Riz surprisingly easily lies to Jawbone. Like, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Jawbone's like, you know, she's not a bad kid. And furthermore, what's that noise? Is there something going on right now? That's world outside. <laughs> um, you see, uh, minute grabbing Kipper Lily's file. So, A plus the road teacher, you and Kipper Lily's file is a lot to go through. Immediately, what you see in Kipper Lily, just from like a quick scan, is uh, she's been coming to the guidance counselor since freshman year for anger issues. Um, and since freshman year, so this isn't just an anger. Freshman anga. year, uh, you, you see uh, your name in her file. Huh? Why? Why though? They cross them. They cross them. So that's what you're able to look at right now. I knew it. I knew it. They can't just hate them. There has to be yeah, a reason. Yeah, yeah, there's something. Totally. It can't just be like, they're more popular or they've saved the world. Like, they have to I really, it would be so cool if there was like, they got a mention in the first season kind of thing. Uh, that's a seven. Okay. Um, you can we get like the, we get the like, the moment of them all like crossing over yeah and, like, yeah, yeah. It, yeah like flashback to yeah. the rest of the yeah yeah go for it so okay. but yeah. pause yeah. like in in like like an movie, ocean's 11 yeah but like in movie vibe. sequels it's like you can tell it's a recreation and you can tell that the current <laughs> actors are aged down and yeah, yeah. the hair looks like a wig just always like, the back of their head yeah, yeah. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> it's just like they so never like, actually like, interact with it's the like person. look they were there the whole time it's like i know that was filmed this year <laughs> That wig is so bad. The wig is so bad, and oh, it's like, like the wig shows. is so bad, and it's a back angle, and then but then the other shot from the original season all of a sudden comes it's in, different. and it's like that twenty two thousands like, like grainy like different footage, film, and then it's filmed like, on film, film and then digital <laughs> all of a sudden. And it's like back and forth, and then the so they always have to grade Blur. the <laughs> digital. It's like a little bit more blurry and in black and white, yeah, yeah, so it's yeah. like you can't tell. But you so know what stupid. I hate is like those flashbacks when they go like. Yeah, I remember in high school and cut to high school, they've got bangs. Yeah, 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 yeah. and they're exactly the same age. Yeah. <laughs> they still look pretty, <laughs> and somehow they're still in high school. So stupid. So stupid. Athletics for Albert. Here we go. Uh, that's a seven. Oh, seven. Um, you can't oh, can I give you a bardic also because it's for Gorthalax? DC is twenty. I'm so worried. Oh my gosh. Uh, four. Eleven. I physically can't do it. Uh, eight. Ah, uh, nineteen. Nineteen. Oh, uh, can't. Guidance. Uh, guys, we all would have gone to his first match. We all would have been 100%. My campaign is going to My campaign. By the way, yeah. uh, I give you my D10 portent, so you yeah, <laughs> start with an 8, eight. so it makes it a 20. 20. Yeah, that's <laughs> it! I give you a 10. Hey, you stole from Jawbone? <laughs> I give you a 10, so it goes down to an 8. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please don't take this wrong way, but are you playing or are you the ball in it? I just don't know. Sports. <laughs> Riz freaks out. <laughs> so what? 
I think the thing I'm going to prioritize is... The whole fit is so cute. So cute. So Barbie. I thought maybe so I'm like My Little Pony. Yeah. I thought maybe it was that I was cursed, but now I've decided that it's because I haven't been working on music. <gasps> oh, I love it. I'm not going to bard class. I'm going to go to hell uh, to my recording <laughs> studio and I'm going to write a super metal song called Dawn of Justice. Yeah. And yeah. Like a cosmic battle between uh, devils and angels. Ooh, amazing. Uh, so give, me, cool. give me performance. Give me a performance check. We need someone in the Dimension 20 18 community to write this album. 38. Oh my God. I have a 20 in performance. Why haven't you been doing this? <laughs> You write this song. You f and finish I your album. Tell you that Rip, your sound engineer, has to like stop at a certain point. He's like, "Hey, we got the whole track. We got the whole thing in the can." When you get out and look at the bottom of the bottomless pit, there's a light at the bottom. <laughs> Is it like a bad thing or a good thing? It looks like a bright, fiery yellow light in distant space, and looking right into on? it, circling up through the bottomless pit, is a small, rotating gust like a dancing tornado of shattered red crystal. Okay. Didn't she? Bad. Okay. That is a 25. On Karna's nice. internal domain, when she died, became like unclaimed as her body floated dead in the astral plane. It looks like Fig has, in her role as an archdevil, through the creation of the most metal song of all time. Dawn of Justice is, like, how many minutes is this song? Um, I think it's like eight minutes. <laughs> uh, I think that also, in order for Gorgug to play the drum part I've written, Adine has to cast Simon Akram, so there's two Gorgugs. <laughs> uh, I love that. I have and to have enlarge one and reduce one. <laughs> so you have a small you sitting four. in your giant lap. <laughs> <laughs> But it's you with a baby Bjorn of the little you. <laughs> I'm gonna hide the cosmic chromatic orb so that's just like fly away from every color. A lot of the sound is actually like symbols being destroyed and ripped yeah. apart. And, and like, were there reloading symbols? <laughs> Riz to go full goblin Jimmy Page on the. <laughs> <laughs> um, this first track for whatever your your self-released Bottomless Pit Records album is going to be, 30 is the highest, D is the cap zero to 38. This song taps you into your position. An album like that, but it was just a photo of Baby as the album cover, and that album's called Baby. Baby, Baby. Yeah. Find greater steed. I wanted to try to create one of the... Um, Horses. Yes. Yes. Of, oh, this massive fiery stallion so cool in the autumn pit it rears up in this like field of broken brimstone and fire sky ah, it screams as like fire and light oh down. my god goes, out of the box. <laughs> that's good that's good yeah i, I think i'm gonna i'm gonna be mad this thing so i want to hi my name is figure out faith um you were once a steed of a great goddess and she's been corrupted but i think that in you remains who she was and who she could still be amazing you let me straddle you <laughs> i do side saddle <laughs> oh, oh my god, god. this is effectively a day mayor. okay you feel a connection to this ancient powerful domain damien basically song on the, the album. result of that incredible performance check but mayor because it's a lady horse song created, but in the act of its creation sorry i didn't get that if yeah Arnold this was a like freak back, her coming back would be basically adjudicated by fig like fig is sort of like sitting on the domain infernally of wow this. I'm that's like amazing hoping that show, like having this thing like would remind her who she was before i kind of want to be like hey porter i've i've been thinking a lot about like my infernal domain, because I'm like supposed to be like getting in touch with myself to write my agreement. And I've been looking into other planes, and I was wondering, have you ever been to the Mountains of Chaos? Other planes? Oh, 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 well, the Mountains of Chaos are in Spire. Oh, they are? Yeah. A lot, a lot of student classes that um, I don't believe your adventuring party ever, you know, ventured to the Mountains of Chaos, but it's a really common location for like freshmen and sophomore year adventures. Really? Like, which other adventuring <laughs> parties have gone there? Um, Just because maybe I can ask them about it. I know the Seven have stopped by on one of their adventures. Yep. I know the Rat Grinders went there uh, many times. Kill me. Um, Kill me. And, you know. Kill me. Uh, uh, I'd say, I'd say, uh, yeah, fair, a fair amount. Um, obviously, your adventures have been largely back by the... Okay, but also, are we going to call the Seven? More concerned with the public <laughs> defense. Girlies! Uh, most, the most kids in school. Someone you know, call Erika Ishii. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, and then I smite him. 
<laughs> and you see that there is an email that is being looped in. The email being looped in uh, is js dash uh, at eggfort.edu. J Star Diamond. Okay. Can I, because I can appear as a messenger, or like I, I can appear as myself. Star Diamond never has a plan. All Star Diamond does is get in my freaking way. Okay, let's uh, go. He, he's always wants Ruben off doing other stuff, yeah. not touring, not yeah. doing gigs. Yeah. It was him that, that, I think it was some kind of conversation with him. Not that a team. Made, the, that made Ruben come to me and say, hey, I I will only perform at Frosty Fair. There you go. This is Spring Tree. Oh, wait. Um, this is interesting information, and then I think I need to just turn it into a standard dream, so I think I, like, turn into her mom. You suddenly think about a cemetery and the fact that the Rose Professor is a ghost. So you have Kipper Lily's file, getting your report cards, which are, like, a little, a little bit late getting to you. Well, they should have gotten at the beginning of the week. You finally get them and open them up. Uh, everything looks, uh, pretty good. Kristen has failed cleric class and is being expelled. What? what? Huh? Hi. Fucking Bobby Don. Bobby Don. Bobby Don. This is bullshit. This is bullshit. <laughs> Okay, okay. can we uh, uh, appeal to Jawbone? Yeah. Too hard. Riz, take a left. Riz, 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 take a left. Take a left. Okay. It's not real. It's I, not real though, right? Let's just, yeah. Wait, what was that? Riz, like, a drink. Give Riz like uh, no. Like a cigarette. They got their report cards back. Okay, I think we need to go to someone and ask. Let's just. What? But how do we not know any of this? Exactly. Exactly. Yeah, you guys completely blindsided them. Yeah, and I tell everyone, I tell everyone what I learned in Lola's dream. Yeah, that Star Diamond was the one that said Ruben will only play at Gorgo's house. Yeah. Star Diamond is the one that fucker. He seems so chill. He's just always playing so a hacky section. Exactly. Yeah, charisma. <laughs> so I think people are getting possessed and stuff. So That's a red flag if I ever heard one. Like we start soft. Are you alright? Yeah. No, I'm not okay. I for sure need a stretch. I'm gonna play. Is this your fifth one? Uh, no, this is my fourth. Yeah, one. Yeah. I, as soon as I see Kristen's thing, I just like. <laughs> Like there's like so a annoying. sound and like just one giant bead of sweat. I think out. I think you have a giant bead of sweat. Year of egg for you a little bit more like you will when you are adults. I think a vein appears on like the side of Riz's forehead that will need to rest. Of <laughs> <laughs> it looks like I love that. Thank you. Good. Can I summon an A, please? <laughs> <laughs> Let, no. Let's go to Jawbone. No, no, no. Soft. no. Oh, so soft. Uh, so Jawbone says. Oh, hey there, kid. How's it going? Oh, failed by Bobby Don. There's, There's been a mistake. There's There's no been failed by Bobby Don. There's no grounds. There's no grounds. There's no grounds. He's going to find grounds. Right. Uh, okay. You don't need a groundskeeper because there's no grounds. Yeah. There it is. Great. Yeah. Keep working. We're hemorrhaging money on the groundskeeper, Javon. <laughs> the coach just has a skipper. <laughs> skipper. Uh, you're, you're absolutely welcome to, to challenge this. I'll challenge. 1v1 if we need. I no think God. it's gonna be, yeah, yeah that's like, like how. I know killing the principal is enough. We've killed the principal. We've taken down the High Council of Valadil or whatever. Honestly, we're coming for the other principal. <laughs> <laughs> All right, look, 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 look. Look, 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 look. Okay, okay, okay. 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 This is like misfits where they kill every social worker. Let's just find out what's going on. Chaplin, what's on the computer? Kristen, your work has been exempted. There's notes in here that your spell casting is, is prodigious. Okay. What Professor Dawn has put in here in, in his notes is that the prior teacher made an allowance for you to proceed in this track without a divinity living. And he, what Mr. Dawn has done is rescinded that and said the cleric, the student in question, was not able to preserve the life of their deity. And regardless of their ability to harness spell casting, uh, this constitutes an immediate uh, failure this last semester, which normally would be overcomable, but because of the academic permission you were already in, it seems that there's no, and there's a note in here about that point being made to Professor Dawn, who said, unfortunately, it is my estimation that uh, an allowance being made in this case was not equitable or fair to other students. Are we in- But also, like, why the hell did you not like tell her? Can I be lying to the clerics? Uh... Yes, I think you guys can all be lying there. No, 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 no,
Go ahead and give me a deception check. Can please, I, please, I please. I send them in with a, with a verdict. Okay, as well. And I can leave that now. 26. He gets oh. a one. He gets a one? Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. I'm just having a real dark night of soul. But it's a day. I understand. I can literally can't sit still. Well, how may I be of service to you, Miss Appleby? Uh, I, um... I saw my grade, and I saw my expulsion letter, and I was wondering if it's not too late to maybe go with what's right there. Oh my god. Oh my god. You mean a return to the worship of Helio? Prodigal as I may be. <gasps> yeah, give him all those buds with, baby girl! Brennan's so proud. Yeah, so proud. Miss Applebee's. I think that's a very wise and noble decision. Let's pray. <laughs> I take his hands. He prays with you. Okay. Let's get that paperwork started. Don't stop. Paperwork? No, there's no paperwork in the pursuit of the Lord. Helio will welcome you with open arms. I imagine you'll have a great deal more time for worship now. Why is that? Because you no longer attend this school, Miss Applebee. Oh, fuck. Even with switching my garment? I believe you. You want to switch your deity. But the rules are the rules, Miss Appleby. I can no longer twist them than I would be able to break the word of the Almighty in my position. You see that you have effectively like deceived him, but that his goal his fundamental goal was to remove you from Eggfort. Yeah. That like you wanting to look for another deity is great to him, but he wants you out of Lily. So Copper Lily can win. Who knows? You Why do they keep saying Copper Lily? The rest of you says Hey, uh, I, I found something of interest, but I see you're all sort of crouched in the hallway with weapons drawn. <laughs> yeah, I can just picture, <laughs> like, Gorgug the size of the hallway, Alice okay. in Wonderland well, style. Well, your grades are all so good. <laughs> they're not, want, they're still poised. You can take the last standard exam. In. In. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Honestly, I, mean, I was hoping we were going to have to anyways. President, we've got a, we've got a twist. I just realized the last standard exam is the last stand. <laughs> when a path is laid before you, it is the height of arrogance to leave it and choose your own. You're a control freak and you'll never win. And I watch. <laughs> My head and it gives my goggles on. Yeah, oh, so cute. Little sonar. Uh, no resistances or immunities. Damn, it's just regular freak. Yeah, <laughs> just so basically under his shoes, so his shoes smell of shit all day. Uh, and nice. I press the digitation of Bart to follow him everywhere he goes. Just an eruption of stinking. I love that they were ready to fight and then they just went. Pity. Yeah. <laughs> You arrive uh, at the hallway. Thomas says, the last standard exam. The point is, it's an endurance test where you are fighting monsters while answering a series of academic questions. Um, and uh, the longer, yes. the longer. Yes. I call them fighting monsters. Someone else do the academic questions. Yes. <laughs> Everyone will have to answer. There'll be a series of desks. Everyone will have to answer some desk. Can we jump on the desk? Everyone, everyone has to answer. There will be twelve questions for all for six of you. You just have to answer two academic questions. Uh, there will be a proctor for the exam. What's a proctor? It, uh, uh, no, Bobby Don. Booking star diamond. Proctor or Gavin Pundle. Great. Uh, I, I can work with that. The name I can work with that. Um, Pundle. 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 Um, let me check my nemesis list real quick. <laughs> I don't think he's on there. So the, <laughs> the exam are fight heroically. Uh, stay up for as long as you possible. You have two on there. It's not uh, that hard not to remember. Let the monsters kill the proctor. That's 30 points off if that happens. Uh, and <laughs> out of 100. Oh, so we could still, if we kill everybody but the proctor dies, we would still get like a seat. Well, then you got the questions. And there will be a cleric on standby uh, to raise you after the exam is concluded. <laughs> Wait, who's the cleric going to be on standby to raise us? Doesn't say there's a rotation. Bobby, obviously, right? So it has Don. Gr Grundle and... <laughs> We can't go Gavin down. Pundle? We can't Gavin go down. Pundle. It's gonna be Bobby Don. He won't. Uh, <laughs> Kevin Pundle Grundle. Uh, get a good night's sleep, and we'll we'll open it up for you first thing in the morning. In right. the morning. Right. Uh, that we go to how are we studying for this? We have to be worried that the cleric teacher won't bring us back. To the <laughs> yeah. It is wild. It is wild. <laughs> uh, we we, we just said that out loud. Because the next day, I think it's because if if um, Kristen is expelled, then immediately the party fails. 
fails. So yeah. they need to take action straight away because mm. otherwise all the other stuff will start right. falling yeah, down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, go. Chalbon they probably Shepherd's got their spells and stuff Principal ready. Egg for its office. Uh, what the hell is that? Place, another Whoa. realm. What is that? The where horse. You see countless Arthur oh Eggforts cheering for you. Countless. <laughs> You'll now behold the last stand. Everyone give it up. You see a bunch have their shirts off with Gorgug painted across their chest in like letters. <laughs> Look at him. This one was falling to pieces. Can you Adam. please come to one? You're all going to do it. This is what this school you. is all you about. Too. Gorgug's over there. Adine's over there. You see people taking pictures. They're talking to each other. But you see sort of this illusory <laughs> army of cheering Arthur Eggforts like in the background who are the all wishing you the best. You can do it. Screw the girl away. Finally, somebody said it. Finally. Story. Winnetou is trans. Sheer story. So annoying. Spell slots. You took one? I am so sorry to do this to you, but this is what being a high level wizard is. Uh, just please get that all away from me. <laughs> get, get away. <laughs> take it, take it. This will be our tenth for your steed. Oh, these are my big B hands? Those are your big B's hands. Yes, yes, yes. Wow, that's so sick. I want a tackle box of things. <laughs> a tackle box. Go fishing, baby. Yeah. I'm going to become a wizard. Oh, I'm going to go fishing. Um, I'm thinking... Of course I'm Ellie wants to go fishing right now. I was right just now. thinking that. <laughs> Buddy stands there, the person stands there, like, uh, this is your grace period. Um, each of the desks has two of your academic questions within it. You are allowed to oh my God, an S. answer those. Right, right, right. Just, each of you will be responsible for two of the 12, but you can uh, ask for help from your fellow party members. Okay, uh, well, he also has armor of Ida on him. Cool. It lasts for an hour duration. Can armor I have of Ida. telepathic, telepathic bond on us? Earlier in the morning, okay. yeah, for sure. I know that Fig hasn't yeah, spent time on it, but I miss the, the random Ida yeah. <laughs> messages through time. <laughs> some, some rats. I didn't have to make a charisma check to make them my friend. Um, I put on, I put but I'm going to summon three swarms of rats. <laughs> Okay. This is so they, freaking uh, crazy. It's so <laughs> random. But it makes sense. Like, in their last stand, they would be pulling, you know, they would be... Every single every thing. Every single thing comes out. Uh, that is a 23. Do you know what would be crazy? The person just comes out. They don't do any attacks. They just cast a spell magic. Like, on well, everything. Like, just that's all they do. Okay, I got a couple things. Conjure Minor Elemental, Mordekainen's Faithful Hound, which is not concentration. I have Rory's Telepathic Bond, which is not concentration. Oh, and actually, I will cast Mirror Image on myself as well. That is also not concentration. Are they allowed to cast that many because they're not an initiative yet? So it's not like one spell per round. It's just... Yeah, I'll throw a bless up to everybody. Oh uh, yeah, bless up. Yeah. Circle of power doesn't really. Do you know what would be bomb? People. Now that they've done the dry guys, if the try guys come on to Richard Twitty. Spin-off series with the try guys, yeah, the dry yeah. guys. <laughs> So it's really just yeah. I wonder how many times they've stuffed up on forgetting the concentration stuff that they decided to make. Circle of powers. Circle 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 out right now, right now, that that rats that they are hot off the presses from when my hands are burning. <laughs> okay, concentration on from when what? Tell us, just now. He said, from when he was gonna say, but got distracted. Look, there's chains on the ground. Uh, the academic Wait. questions within on every these corner. desks, the monsters will be coming out of these four gates yeah, at regular so. intervals until you are all dead. He says it lasts until we die. It is the last stand. Yes, absolutely. Oh, okay. oh. Well, then we have a serious problem with the fact that a, the, that the cleric is biased. Uh, excuse me, sir. Are you biased? You see Buddy goes, no. And you see he goes, can we at least okay. zone of truth that real yeah, quick? Uh, zone of truth that real quick? <laughs> hit it with a zone of truth. Mr. Don hit has with already the... sworn a magical oath that will okay. completely strip okay. him of his divine connection to his deity should he uh, refuse in any way. Okay. To... I wonder if he freaking took devil's nectar to do so. Um, so if we all, oh. just, just clarifying the rules since we're all going to die, oh um, I feel God. like that's fair for it to do. Yeah. Um, if we all, let's say we stagger our deaths and our personal party cleric is the one to bring us up, does that still count as a die? We all have to be dead at the exact same time. You see, he says, we have you to see, each have died once and then uh, we get the You see that one of the Eggforts stands up in the crowd and says, you should, of course, try to bring your friends back from the dead. Of course, <laughs> it's never happened in the school's history. 
But you could, theoretically, be the first students not to die in the last stand exam. Pretty maximum legend. I mean, I, how does that work, though, if it doesn't stop until they all die? You see, Gavin does look out and say, technically, there are a limited amount of monsters. monsters. Right, okay. okay. I love it. I love it. I'm changing my thing to cat's voice. <laughs> okay, Riz. I'm going to explain I think, he's a, I think he's a stooge. I think that's a waste of a spell. Okay. Many episodes ago, academic resources were promised. Uh, Gorgug rolled two nat 20s on academic uh, trash and his, you may 100% stamp two of the 12 questions as your two academic resources. Uh, 100%. I mean, it completely out of range. I only get two uses out of 12 questions on that 100%. Does that count? Uh, does that count? I'm going to get everybody here to roll initiative. Three out of sitting there. Three out of sitting there. Incredible. So sick. I also sick. say that you guys have huge academic surpluses, growls and snarls behind these gates, and can ready actions if you want to be able to use your reactions to nice. do stuff. Nice. That's cool. Yeah. I'm just going to jump straight. Guys, we got levers. What the hell? Guys, we got levers. 19 on the die. And chains? Yeah, right. And zips? And <laughs> And six. Uh, <laughs> 22 does look possible is the potential for getting monsters out sooner. So if you wanted to like slot in a monster that's going to come the next round, oh, wow. what purpose you would want more monsters on the field, you could do that. Could, would it be possible to ready Ooh, an thinking, thinking. How do you like, game that? Would it be possible to like ready? I'll give you the help action. Oh, thanks. Hey, who? Growl, who? Growl, who? Growl, who? Growl, who? Go, 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 go. Brands, tingles, right? Yeah, yeah. So, uh, we should have done slick back pony. Oh, okay. They forgot. <laughs> One, two, three, four determines the order of the gates that the monsters come out of. Did they do slick back um, pony last that's time? That's three, so this will be our no, gate number right. one. Lurching okay. well, out I just of this gate, a, the a fearsome oh, no, 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 no. Emerging on the battle, a massive hydra takes oh. the field. Oh my gosh. So it's going to have to deal with those methods and everything else. Let's go with the ones by the hydra first. The blue things are the methods? It's a 15 on the die from Sid Rats. So that's 17. That's yes, good, yeah. A 17 hits the Hydra. It's pretty good. 2d6 piercing. And they have keen smell, too. Uh, they do seven points of damage on the Hydra. Yes. <laughs> I don't need to crawl up and bite and, like, find... They're just killing them. Circular breathing. <laughs> uh, Circular breathing? <laughs> Incredible. Okay, they start attacking the Hydra, and you notice that they are attacking the Hydra's I just realized that Edan was talking to... Like going into, like, the, the places in between. Bob, so it Bobby Dawn. Because like like yeah. they like kill them. Uh, like, no, no, no. That's a 19 on the die. That yep. Yeah. Skeleton rats and skeleton rats. Uh, that's nine points of piercing damage. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> really good job against this skeleton. Oh my gosh, look at... <laughs> Roll for the ones that are attacking this Gorgon over here. Only a nine for those rats. Three are down. The badly injured one is one of the ones that goes down because it starts with the lowest hit point total first. Oh, so having that top camera means less work if, if for post-production film. They'll, they'll filming. Up. Um, okay. They don't have to next, do it every time. They don't have to reenact every yeah. time. For the, for the, uh, the Otayug, late to the party because of how slow they are, emerging behind the Otayug from this stinking hole, oh. three ochre jellies oh, uh, no. emerge. Oh, no. Ew! <laughs> Uh, oh, I was like, do they have little hats? But it's because they have numbers on them, I think. Oh. <laughs> if they ever do a second season of Star Trek, I hope they do it back in computer. Like, yes, I want to see, like, figurines, but I also love that it was, like, in the laptops. I think that's where it works, yeah. Or somehow do um, holograms of everything. Yeah. Disgusting, I hate that. That looks disgusting. At the beginning of initiative, they have been started in initiative. Full turn. Great, I look at my desk. At your desk, you see two folders. The two folders at your desk say investigation and history. Okay. Start with investigation. You will have two minutes wow. for this question. Oh my god. Uh, you will have two minutes this for this question. Actual this is scary. Actual actual scary. scary. Actually, 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 this is literally an actual. Oh! It's got the scary shit on it. I'm seeing it triggering. Just the way absolutely, that it out. Absolutely. Absolutely. Wait, so how does it. Two minutes. Remember that you do have. If you feel you need to give up, you have to stamp it before your time <laughs> is out. Okay. Riz, you grab investigation. Your time starts now. Okay, um, and we all work together. We love that, we love that. Bone girth, it just says. I just think it's funny that they gave this to Riz because um, he was the one who did not yorb. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Okay, go, go, go. Oh, Katia Bryan, Katia Bryan. No, not Natalie does. No? Also no apostrophe. D-O-N-Y? D-O-N-Y. 
G R T H. Is it Gardy? It feels like it was Gardy O'Brien. Gardy? No, it's not. Oh, but it's like a bat. Yeah, hang on. O'Brien, O'Brien, B R I. Hang on. No, no, no. So B O N Y space G I R T H. G I. Night. Night your. Oh, night your. You I can't believe I said it. Like, yeah. <laughs> get on the desk writing as you do that. Uh, Gorga, would you give me the honor of just stamping that 100%? Oh, wait, that's, that's not using one. That's not using okay. it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. You guys want to get it? That's so cute. Hell yeah, let's go. Last stand exam. Um, okay. That's, that's, okay. that's, um, that's, that's not. Oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to... Uh, <laughs> Misty step in. So okay. cute. Okay. Uh, so that if this thing moves, it takes more damage. I love that. He didn't um, think about the knight yorb, um, but in the rearrangement, he still went for knight first. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like he went when he rearranged that <laughs> other. What was the word before? The original word? Girthy. Something. It was Garthy O'Brien before. That's going to definitely hit. No, it wasn't Garthy O'Brien. Because it was not enough letters to be on. No, no. In the original knight yorb season, oh, in season one. Oh, yeah. What was the word? I think you're right. Yeah, I think it was Gaddy O'Brien, and they're trying to figure out, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, what yeah. to spell, and he was yeah. like, Night yeah. Yorb? Yeah. <laughs> it's so funny. Great, okay. Are you so he still went night. 42 damage? Yeah. 42 damage. Nice. Okay, you see in the back of its throat, okay. it does have two folders, but it is going to attack you as it appears first. So epic. That's what school feels like. Ugh. Fabian, you take 14 points <laughs> of damage. Don't you know it. It you with its tongue and bites into your leg. Yeah. It didn't miss at all. It did not miss on its attack. Unless you're, unless you're doing any shield or anything like that. Yeah. Ah, watch out! <laughs> <laughs> um, connect his desks! Um, because you have been... I'll take athletics. Yeah, do that. <laughs> athletics. That's so funny, him making one this. Minute. Make it a real, a real test. Like, they can't... Okay. Mm. It's not a roll situation. Yeah. In three, two, one. Uh, what rival blood rush team do our beloved Owl Bears most often compete against? A, the Buccaneers, which are from Bastion City, no. Yes. B, the Hellions. C, the Grapplers, or D, the Scoundrels? Hellions. Hellions? Do we think it's the Hellions? No, I think it's the Buccaneers. I thought it was the Buccaneers. No, but that's the professional team that Rog is actually currently training right. for. Yeah, so, uh, yes. so I do think it's right. the, uh, the, the Hellions. 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 The Hellions. I love it, this is so cool. <laughs> <laughs> Through it. What's this pressure. thing? Okay, um, yeah. Does the hangman itself do? Yeah, the hangman can attack on. Oh, I know. Uh, does it get my chance to it's fire like... damage or dismount and let it turn into a hound? Fire! I am ready to fight. I'll Sorry, kill you. Great. Wow. Hangman appears. Ooh. It's gonna act on your turn. Great. And I think we're gonna charge. Uh, that one. That one. Egg fort behind him is asleep. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, trying to get two heads. Okay. <laughs> that brings me up to 23 AC. Ooh. Uh, 31 points of damage on the first attack. Lovely. We'll swing again. Yup. That's another 20 to hit. 20 hits. Go ahead, roll damage. You come up and uh, grab one head. You put your sword through one eye. Yeah. And out the other. Wow. Nice. Uh, talk that slash through the head, rip it off. Half a third head. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. This thing is looking so rough. It's Ooh. two of five heads. That was a really cool shot because it, it was like mid fall. That. Yeah. That, mm -hmm. that third head. Mm -hmm. Two of five heads. You feel your body just like there's no falling off the van. Uh -huh. no, can't jump on the table. Yeah. You have spent months. So good. Perfect unison. Three of the heads are locked off by Fabian in one turn. Three sixes, two threes, and a five. Oh, amazing. Fire damage, I'm assuming. Does that seal them all up? Does that seal them the all up? It made it save. Takes half damage. And still in one turn. Yeah. Beautiful. And answered a question. That he's been working on a class. None of the rigidness of stabbing. It's just jumping, rolling over heads to stab. So good. Beautiful. To do sit ups to pop heads off. Beautiful. Uh, it's elegant. It's gorgeous. Um, blood sprays everywhere. Uh, and I think Fabian literally like like ends it. Uh, in kind of like a, a bow. Oh. Take the last head off the hangman goes. <gasps> and fire so epic. So epic. Someone paint that. There's like a. Yeah. Renaissance painting. On his big, bony, infernal paws, 
bows and mirror of you. Oh, beautiful. It's like when they so dance epic. with their dog. <laughs> <laughs> And after baby's turn, the Hydra was up next. Oh, wow. Incredible. Uh, incredible. <laughs> Hydra, it. no more. Off Spring the break. <laughs> it's Gavin Pundle's turn. Gavin, Gavin Pundle? Pundle gets a turn. Gavin Pundle goes, okay, and writes something down in the little book. Uh, Sounds like a good thing. Uh, Sounds like a good guy. Yeah. The Mimic is going to take a swing at Adam. <laughs> so it's going to interact, I believe, with Mirror. If it hits me, I then roll. It does hit. No, it does all right, one of your duplicates. Uh, Blades out of existence at the mimic attacks. Figure off Faith, that is your turn. Yeah. I feel like. I, I, yeah, I think, think they're so weak too. to fire. I think think they're yeah, they're jellies. Like they're but they're wet. He's never going to be able to deal with these dudes, and these dudes are coming for the proctor. Great. Yeah, I love nice. it. We're going to do a. Fish We're going to do. That's absolutely fine. I will just level fireball and everyone here. I wish to die. Mythical <laughs> fireball. That's going to hit absolutely everybody. Yes. Okay. Don't hit Buddy. No. <laughs> A lot of twos and threes. Okay, but that's a lot of dice. Uh, 33 five. damage. It's too Astride your Daymare, this horse of the former goddess Ankarna, you watch as the Otaya, the method, and both of the smaller jellies vanish. Nice, Talk nice, nice, nice. Let me describe to you what the spell looks like as it erupts over the battlefield. Throw a bunch of, I summon a bunch of rebellious flame. And throw it yeah. Yeah. Rebellious yeah. flame. Song blasts. Yeah. It looks like oh, that's beautiful. That's so cool. That's so cool. <laughs> Remaining are this big. Oh, oh, oh my god, they're so big. Look at their little baby babies. Um, and, and, and I'm gonna take, I think, three attacks on the bull. Cool. Yeah. Go for it. A reckless. Nat 20. Ah! Nat 20. Yup! Yeah. Don't make him roll the last one. Just. What the fuck is going on? Uh, <laughs> Uh, 16 on the die. That's funny. They are all three wow, going to hit. Yes, range attacks? Yes, range with the with the returning axe. Fucking unreal. That's amazing. <laughs> that's, this is the first two attacks. 10. Okay, that's... Holy shit. 3, 44. 44 plus um, 16. 44 plus 16. 60 points of damage. And, plus, and then, then one more attack uh, for another... <laughs> 10. 70. 70 points of damage. Wow. Death. Amazing. Oh, okay. Gorgon leaps onto the structure with the proctor on it and the heavy metal axe. The feeling of Gorgon throwing the <laughs> It's not that you are blown away from it. You actually all feel yourself tugged in its direction. Like it's gaining so much mass that it gains a gravitational pull. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing math. <laughs> This bull is slammed up against the wall. Yeah. Amazing, amazing. Uninjured to badly bloodied in a single turn. Gorgon, that is your turn. Mm -hmm. The initiative is nuts in this battle. How much you guys have taken out the enemies all right before they were about to go. Wow. Yeah, yeah did I get him? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I believe that you were. <laughs> got him? <laughs> Hold on. Stand by, stand by. Uh, are we gonna call it? No, no, when it fails, it's saving throw against your turn. Mission accomplished. Okay. <laughs> 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 they need 18s or higher. No way, no way, no way. Do they have any 18s? Eight of them. Some of them are asleep. Do they autofill? <laughs> Doesn't matter. Uh, Doesn't matter. Uh, Love that. Oh, just like shining purple, <gasps> shimmering light. Cassandra, question mark. Big question. Giant question mark, the hook of which piles them all up and slams them deep into Wow, them. beautiful. Love that. Chill night air. A cool breeze. You were all so refreshed. Epic. Normally, I tend to end our episodes in cliffhangers, moments of doubt and sudden turning of the tides. Instead, here at the last stand, we end in a moment of unbridled triumph, competence, acclaim, and victory. For the bad news, we Next week on another episode of Dimension 20. Wow. What Holy a great mollies. episode. I, I feel like there was so much that happened, but because the, the battle was last, it's like I can't remember what actually was in this episode and yeah. what was the last episode. No, we found out about Jace. Yes. Crazy times. Okay, so we're seeing the connections with the faculty here. Um, and that, that he has something to do with the rat grinders as well as Principal Grix, which I feel like kind of obviously they were all connected, but it's like starting to come together. And what did we... Yeah, 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 yeah. I was like... Also, Hopclap is good. Hopclap is good. I think we good. already knew, right? He was too nice to... 
Yeah, I think it was a red herring to be like, oh, he's related. And also, we found the freaking um, the ghost professor. Yes, we found the ghost Which professor. Which we haven't been yet about you yet. pay off to your theory. So sometimes we get theories. Right. So sometimes we get things right. Hey, um, but sometimes. you know what's crazy is... If you guess a lot, you'll get one right. Henry Hopclap had written a letter raising concerns about Ruben. So I'm really curious about that. Um, and obviously, The Last Stand is so epic. And so epic. Obviously, Brandon summed it up really well. But like competence yep. in combat and everything mm-hmm. that they had. I mean, obviously, these are professional players, but oh, just so Still satisfying. So good. I feel so like good. I feel like we just go straight to the next episode. You can see us next time. So we'll see you in the next episode for episode 15. Let's go. Guys, end, end streak. End, end streak. End streak. What is that? It's the third act. In the 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 final streak. The, the last, last stand. stand. <laughs> Of the night you're... Of the night you're... Bye.